you can do pretty much everything on these smartphones nowadays. Internet, emails, and apps. I'm sure you've heard people talking about apps. These are, that's short for applications. They're a booming business at the moment. These apps are downloaded onto your phone and you can get anything from, from a game or BBC news service to full-blown satellite navigation systems. Well, Dragon's Den star and businessman James Khan is launching a new app today and joins us now. What do I need to look for, James? Good morning. Good morning. Um, I think what you need to look for is an app called James Khan's Business Secrets. And this is my opportunity to share some of my ideas and experiences on how to establish and run a business, whether that's about raising capital or managing people or attracting the right talent, social media, marketing, raising finance. So basically what I've done is kind of taken back the last 20 years on some of the challenges that I faced and put that into an application, an app you know, so that people from every aspect of business, whether they're turning over £100,000 a year or £100 million a year, can actually access something where they're in the train or they're at home, they're on the tube. They can either watch it on video, they can read it on text, or in fact, they can listen to it on audio. Um, It just gave me an opportunity really to to share, you know, with people who want to be entrepreneurs, Mm. some of the things that I felt were important to me when I was you know, establishing the business. But James, you're an incredibly successful businessman. Why would you want to give your secrets away? Because I think it's, you know, I think whenever somebody gets to a point where they've been reasonably successful, there's always an inspiration or a motivation to want to to share that with other people. And I think for me, um, I would love to see more people doing well. I'd love to see that Britain becoming a very entrepreneurial society. Mm. And I think the number of people we meet today who have such aspirations of wanting to be successful and for me i think the most important thing is they've got to have every chance of being successful because it's not that easy there are thousands of this year i think there'll be 33,000 businesses that will fail and i think you know whatever we can do to ensure and help people and guide them through those challenges you know i think it's fantastic james is your app free it absolutely is free so you're not making any money on this at all? I'm making no money on it at all. That's not very it's business. That's not very business like James. <laughs> no, I think I, I took the view that, you know, if this was an opportunity where I could give something back, you know, for me that was quite important. And, you know, yes, I could make money out of it, I could have charged for it. But I think in life it's not always just about making money. I think it's about, you know, wherever you can you know, to to doing a little bit of good or maybe giving something back. And I think that in itself, I think, is quite important where, you know, if people perceive you to be a role model, I think it's important not always just to be seen, Mm. that everything you do has to have a price tag attached to it. Yeah, and there's there's traps. You as a business person, you know, you will probably fall into some of these traps and, you know, we learn as we go along. But there's this turnover thing, isn't it? You know, I'm sure you meet people every day and say, my turnover is £27 million. Turnover isn't profit. They say turnover is for vanity and profits for sanity, is that right? Absolutely right. And I think, you know, too many people chase customers just because they can say, you know, I've got a customer turning over a million pounds a year. The problem is you have to deliver that product or service and you need the infrastructure to deliver that. And if you're not making any margin, you know, it is a recipe for disaster. And I think especially in difficult market conditions, you have to be very conscious that when you're attracting new customers... You can't win them at any cost. Okay. You know, I, I, and also it's very difficult because once you've accepted a customer at a particular price, it's very hard to push that price up. You know, the price will always come down, but it will very rarely go up. All right. Uh, James, uh, what's the name of the app? What do we need to look for? You go onto the Apple iTunes site and yep. you tap in James Khan's Business Secrets and you'll see it as the number one app on the market at the moment. Okay. And there's not a penny in it for you, James. There's not a penny in it for me. You're losing your touch. You've gone soft, man. You've gone soft. (laughs) James, good good to talk to you. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. Bye-bye.